Hi, welcome to Seriously Sonoma Valley. I'm Tracy Rainess, and today we're here learning about McCormick's Mercantile in Glen Ellen. So I'm here with Sherry McCormick. She and her husband Robert own McCormick's Mercantile, and she's going to tell us just a little bit about the store in general. Hi, um, Robert and I came to uh, Sonoma Valley and opened McCormick's Mercantile one year ago. This is uh, very close to our anniversary date. Um, we're in this area because my daughter and her family are in Sonoma and we were living in Atlanta. They lobbied long and hard to get us out here and we thought what a beautiful place to come and spend our retirement. However, retirement turned into this shop. So um, we're very excited and happy to be here. As it turns out, our son-in-law, Stephen Sorkin, had just purchased this building and I had had a similar business in the Atlanta area and he asked, what do you think? Do you want to run a business again and a shop? And so we took a look inside. We thought it was just a lovely space. And so here we are. We, um, we pride ourselves on bringing in local artists and craftspeople. Um, and we also love to support California um, businesses. So what type of products do you have here? Are they made by locals? Are they um, California products? Is there something you specialize in or something you look for to feature in your store? I'm really glad you asked that because we're kind of described as an eclectic uh, group of merchandise. We do feature local artists and craftspeople. We also have a lot of uh, California um, vendors that we, we sell and U.S. made whenever we can. Things that fall out of that category are items that we just really are in love with and couldn't be without. Another thing that we do that separates us from a lot of other um, shops is we have old items as well as new items. So we have furniture, maybe china, lamps, that sort of thing from estates, estate sales. And uh, because I believe in a blending of the old and the new makes a more interesting um, Product base. Product base, base. thank yeah. you. Yeah. yeah, it is pretty diverse in here. It's very cool. And I'm noticing there's, looks like there's a lot of original artwork as well. So that I would assume is probably more local, more specific. Right, absolutely, local. absolutely. Yeah. We have um, some of our artists live just right around the, the block in the neighborhood. And then some other folks are a little bit further out as far as way as Sonoma. Um, so far away. Yeah, so, so very far <laughs> away. And we have folks that are. Um, a little further out. We've got oil painters, we've got uh, beautiful uh, water watercolor painters, acrylics, small things, large things. We uh, have a little bit of a philosophy about what people will buy in the way of art and that is often for us because we are a tourist location, small pieces. So we want to have things that are small enough for somebody to be able to come in, uh, pick out, buy, put it in their suitcase and take it home with them. A little bit of uh, California, a little bit of Sonoma Valley goes to someplace else in the country or the world. Yeah. And how do you feel about Glen Ellen in general? How it's it's a community that really embraces its residents. Have you enjoyed being here? Oh yeah, we absolutely love it. We just live right off Sonoma Creek, uh, seven minutes away. Having been in Atlanta, where the um, commute was a half an hour any way you went, uh, being able to get to work in seven minutes is great. Being able to say hello to neighbors by name as you're walking down the street is really fun and exciting. We've had incredible support here. People were really thrilled when a little shop came into the community. Sure. Uh, we've got some great restaurants, some fabulous tasting rooms, but we're the only shop in town and we're, uh, we're really pleased with that. And we hear all the time um, that people are very glad we're here. So. Yeah, I can see that. Yeah. And I'm assuming, just for our viewers, your seven minute commute is your walk, not a drive, right? Oh, that is correct. <laughs> that, that's absolutely correct. Yes. yes. I know you live just down the street, so right, that right, tough right, seven right. minute walk to work. Yep. Just which is what it. most people would be very envious of. So, so you, you've definitely had no shortage of opportunity for finding the products that you want to put in your store, because it's that every, there's a little bit of everything everywhere. Is that kind of what you were going for, is, is a nice diverse range of products? Right. Well, we wanted to be able to bring products in um, that would be good for locals, 
as well as tourists. So if you need a birthday card or, a, or you're going to, to dinner and you have to get a quick gift, as locals often do, um, we've got it here, we've got something for you. But we also have things for tourists, we've got things for bored kids who are in car, on car trips with their parents. Um, we try to have something for everybody who might come in the door. And then um, we just have so much talent locally too. We've got a lot of our jewelry is made by um, local artists and beautiful silver pieces, copper pieces. Um, we have hand stitched items. We've got some adorable pot holders that are made locally, aprons, um, uh, throws that are made by a, a shawl type wraps that are made by um, one of our neighbors who lives just up the hill. And it's fun when folks come in and say they've got this product or that and, uh, and would I be interested in carrying it. When we can, we try to fit it in. Um, right now, we're pretty cool, but we, um, we always love seeing the new things that people are doing. So this is probably a tough question, but how would you describe your shop in just one or two sentences? I would say that we're an eclectic mix of merchandise for old and young, of old and young things. Um, we, have, uh, we have something for people who live near and far. And really, if you want it, we probably have it or we can get it. Good. Lots of people um, consider us as a perfect resource for gift giving. We have beautiful bath and body products. We have um, robes and, um, and sleepwear that folks love. Of course, we're in wine country, so we have wine gifts as well. Um, and, and our price range is from something inexpensive to something that you would, a dear gift that you would give somebody close to you. So it really sounds like you've made a special place for yourself here in town. And congratulations on your one year anniversary. Thank you, Tracy. It's just been a pleasure being here and we hope to be here for a long time. Great. Thanks for watching Seriously Sonoma Valley and joining us here at McCormick's Mercantile and Glen Ellen. Don't forget to like, comment, and share this with your friends. And we'll see you next time on Seriously Sonoma Valley. That's good. These are, I'm guessing,